The Holy Tales. Hello, everyone, and we're back to hear a new story from the Bible. Come, let's go to Holy. Welcome, kids. I knew you'll be here soon. Today, I'm going to tell you the story about Jesus getting anointed by Mary. So, are you children ready for it? Oh yes, we are. Jesus was sent to Earth by God, His Father, for a specific reason. He was sent to the Earth to help people to connect with God. The end of this plan led to Jesus taking the cross for the sins of the people. He tried over and over to tell his disciples that he was going to die, but they failed to understand his message. Now, the end of his time on earth was coming near, and it was very important for them to understand quickly. Jesus knew that his ministry on earth is going to get over soon enough. He tried telling his disciples about what was coming, but they never really understood. One night. Jesus and his disciples were having dinner at Mary's house with her sister Martha and Lazarus. Martha served dinner, and while they were eating, Mary brought a jar of very expensive perfume. She went up to Jesus and slowly poured the perfume on his feet and wiped them dry using her own hair. The sweet fragrance of the perfume filled up the entire house. Jesus's disciples watched Mary doing this. Some of them got very upset. Judas Iscariot said, "What a waste of money! This expensive perfume could have been sold for a lot of money, and that money could have been used to help the poor." Judas did not really care about the poor. He was in charge of the disciples' money, and he often stole from their funds for his own use. Jesus had an answer for Judas's concern. He said, "Don't stop her from doing such a good thing for me. You will always have poor people around you, but I will not be here much longer. She has poured this perfume on me to prepare my body for burial. I promise that whenever my stories are told throughout the world, this woman's deeds will be mentioned." Gumbo. You've been keeping very quiet today. Did you not like the story? Oh yes, I did, Holy. I was concentrating on the story so that I can answer your question perfectly. <laughs> That's nice. So today's question is only for you. Let's see how much attention you've paid. Go on. Well, today's question is. Who were Jesus and his disciples having dinner with? That's such an easy question, Holy. They were all having dinner with Mary, her sister Martha, and her brother Lazarus. Excellent, Gumbo. Well done. Hope you all got the answer correct too. We'll be back soon. Until next time. Happy kids. TV.